I actually visited one of my favorite places, 100 famous views of Edo, drawn by Hiroshi Gendo, and what the scene is like now. 039, distant view of Kinryuzen Temple and Azumabashi Bridge depicts the view of Sensohi Temple and Azumabashi Bridge over the boat floating on the Sumida River near Mukojima 2CHOME, Sumida Ku. First of all, take a look at the current Apple map. I put a red gradation in the place that seems to be Hirishige's point of view. Today, the Toba Line Railway Bridge, Kodoabashi Bridge, and the glasses-shaped Sakurabashi Bridge are built upstream of Azumabashi Bridge. It seems that the scenery was just seen over the boat floating around the lower reaches of Sakurabashi Bridge. I put a map of that time on this. You can see that Sensohi Temple occupies a fairly large area. Next, let's take a closer look at Hiroshige's paintings. The place depicted in the picture was the passing of Takeya from Sanibori to Mukojima, but this boat is a boat for playing in the river of Edo citizens called a roof boat, and it is surrounded on all sides by bamboo blinds. Today, the boats that surround the Sumida River and Tokyo Bay with shoji screens are called houseboats, and at that time they were mainly used by samurai. On this left bank, Mukojima, there is my Meguri Shrine, and many restaurants, including Hiraiwa, were lined up around it. The rich man, who is enjoying cherry blossom viewing from the surface of the river leisurely with a geisha, can imagine whether he will go there or return to the wind in the cherry blossoms storm. What's more, it looks like a pretty fashionable woman, as you can imagine from the tortoiseshell hairpin of this geisha, who can only see half of her body, and the pattern of the kimono she wears. Due to the resolution, I enlarged the main part of the post print, which is not the first print, but has a slightly different color, and placed it on the right side. From the right, you can see the temple in five-storied pagoda of the main hall of Sensohi Temple on the other side of Kenryu Zanchitakaramaki, Yamanoshi Ukuraku Ukencho, Yamanoshi Ukacho, and Hanukawadako. From under the roof of the boat, Mount Fuji, which still has snow on its peak, and Azumabashi Bridge are drawn on the other side of the cherry blossoms storm. I actually went here. That is this photo. The bridge in front is Kodoabashi Bridge, and you can see the Toba Railway Bridge on the other side. I can't see Azumabashi Bridge at all. Sensohi Temple is also behind the building and cannot be seen at all. On the far left are the Sumida Ward Office and Dusahi Brewery's headquarters. This is a picture of the same place published in the book, 100 Famous Views of Edo, published in 1919. The five-storied pagoda of Sensohi Temple is barely visible here. This is a photograph of Hirishige's viewpoint from the left bank of Kotoabashi Bridge during the cherry blossom season. The area around the white boat on the left seems to be the viewpoint. This is a photo that is a little closer with the angle raised. In the foreground is the Sumedogawa Terrace on the right bank of the Sumida River. It is Mimiguri Shrine on the right bank side of the viewpoint. At that time, many restaurants were lined up around this area. This is a photo of the current Azumabashi Bridge from the right bank, looking toward a ward office. The current Azuma Bridge is a red steel framed four-lane sidewalk with two sidewalks. It was first built in October 1774 at the request of the citizens at the place where Takejo Ferry had been handed over as the last bridge in the Edo period. Therefore, tolls were collected for each two sentences from passers-by other than samurai, and at that time it was called Akawubi Ashi Bridge from another name of Sumida River. From the time it was replaced in 1876, it became known as Azumabashi, and in 1887 it was reborn as the first iron bridge on the Sumida River. This is the postcard issued at that time. It was a very fashionable bridge, wasn't it? This is a photograph of the viewpoint from the right bank of Azumabashi Bridge. You can see the Toba Railway's iron bridge, and beyond that is Kotoabashi Bridge. 
This is the current Sensohi Temple Hazaman Gate and Five Story Pagoda. The current Five Story Pagoda is on the left side of the Hazaman Gate when facing the main hall, but it was on the right side when the painting was drawn. This is a series of three works of the panoramic view of Sensohi Temple drawn by Hiroshi. The lower side is the Dempuan side, and the upper side is the Nitinman side. You can see that the five-story pagoda is on the right side of the Hazaman Gate, which was called the Niaman Gate at that time. At Sensohi Temple, the Buddhist statue on the net of the brothers who were fishing in the Sumida River in 628 was renovated into a temple by the brothers' boss, Nakato Mohaji. It is said to be the beginning. The picture on the left is Hirishaj's origin. One theory is that the Kanon statue, which was enshrined at Iwata Canon in Iwabuchi, Eno City, was washed away by heavy rain about 100 years before the founding of Sensohi Temple. After that, Sensohi Temple developed greatly, and in the Edo period, it was regarded as the Kanon sacred place of the Tokugawa Shogunate and attracted many worshippers. Hirishaj's drawing of the bustle of Lunar New Year Fair at that time is the picture on the right. The five-story pagoda was destroyed by the bombing of Tokyo by the U.S. military in 1945, but was rebuilt in 1973 with reinforced concrete and aluminum alloy tiled roofs. This is the main hall of Sensohi Temple, which disappeared in the 1945 bombing of Tokyo, was rebuilt in 1958, and was dubbed into titanium roof tiles in 2009, which became a hot topic. This is Nakamai's street, which continues from the busy Kaminariman gate, but thanks to Corona, tourists are completely hidden. Then, I modified the photo from the current Hirishage's point of view and fitted it into the picture. What looks big is not Azumabashi Bridge, but Kotoabashi Bridge. What do you think? It's a luxurious and rich river play where you can see the crowded Sensohi temple from a distance by letting a geisha sacrifice on a roof boat in the cherry blossoms storm, but strangely, it doesn't look stylish.